Hello everybody, and welcome back. Here we are again. Um, we're back in it. Uh, everybody else is playing Far Cry 6 today, and uh, I'm over here playing a little bit of Mass Effect 3. I'll tell you why. Because, as I promised, we were going to start Mass Effect 3 up in October, because I want to roll this trilogy, folks. We've done 1 and 2, and now we're going to get into 3. And this, this is it. This is the finale. This is, well, this is the beginning, but this is the end of this, the trilogy. And it took so long to get here. You know, when I, I remember when this game first came out, and I was so excited for it. And I love this game. I know a lot of people have problems with the ending and everything like that, but I love this game. And I love it even more than two. So, we're going to get into this. I think just extra just cheetahs and shit, right? Yeah. So we're gonna import our Mass Effect 2 character, of course. We saved the Rachni Queen. We rescued Caden, who can fuck off for all I care. Uh, we chose the Sacrifice Council. We saved Malin's data. We kept Rex alive. Chose to rewrite the Geth Heretics. Uh, left the collector base, Cerberus survived with all of our squad mates. We did not romance Caden before Mass Effect 2. That is a lie. And I didn't. And you're right, I didn't romance anyone in Mass Effect 2. Switch careers. Oh, I was like, what do you mean, switch careers? Alright, so there we go. Uh, yeah, last uh, in September, so we're pretty much about a month out, so. Here we go. Let's begin, shall we? Just of course, accept the imported face. We didn't, I don't think we changed at all, did we? So this is like tactical cloak and we have like all of our enemies for that. And we have all our allies for that. Frag grenade, incendiary ammo, yep. Structure ammo, cryo ammo. That's what I want. So, I'm gonna keep going with that. So, remember the end of the last game? Uh, we were gonna be uh, held accountable for what we did. Uh, on that asteroid. How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long-range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. In 2157, humanity discovered that it was not alone in the universe. 30 years later, they found a peaceful place among the dozens of galactic species. Blah, 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 blah. Are the Reapers, the sentient race of machines responsible for cleansing the galaxy of all organic life over 50,000 years. About to return, the leaders of the galaxy are paralyzed by a decision and unacceptable to accept the legend of the Reapers as fact. But one soldier has seen the legend come to life. And now... The fate of the galaxy depends on her. You gotta read fast, bro. Fast. Fast. <laughs> so here we are on Earth. I told you we were gonna be held accountable for the shit we pulled on that asteroid. Here we are. Commander. You're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. Played by uh Fred Fred, Fred from Scooby Doo himself. What's going on? <laughs> Fred Couldn't Fred say. Jr. Just told me they needed you. Now. Anderson? 
Admiral. You look good, Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. It's donut day. Something big's headed there our way. There are fresh, hot the donuts. We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. Uh, I mean, I'm certain. I might to adjust the volume as well the when we reverse. get to, uh... And we're not ready for them. Not by a long shot. Tell that to the defense We're gonna get some bombs here in a little bit. To death, the committee is a waste of time. They just scared. None of them have seen. Be the reapers are coming for Donut Day. You face down a reaper. Hell, you spoke to one. They blew the damn thing up. You've seen. I how spoke they to multiple. Us, what they plan to do to us. You know more about this enemy than anyone. That way they grounded me, took away my ship. You know that's not true. When you blew up the Batarian relay, hundreds of thousands of Batarians died. It was that or let the Reapers walk through our back door. I know that, Shepard. And so does the committee. If it wasn't for that, you'd have been court-martialed and left to rot in the brig. That and your good word. Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no huh? politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. Anderson? Great. Shepard. Okay. Don't even eye me. Don't even Admiral. eyeball me, buddy. Okay, I think. Hard to know. I'm just waiting for orders now. Major. You hadn't heard? No, I Major pain in the ass. Sorry, Shepard. It's been... Well... I'm not gonna romance you, but I'll That's say okay. it's good to see you. Just glad I bumped into you, Caden. Yeah. He's a friend, so... Me too. Admiral. Come on. Smile at me like that. See that hunk behind you, know, you? Commander? I used to. I can lay back. I can see my house from here. Literally. There it is, right there. Yo, y'all get in on Donut Day? Because they brought in the Krispy Kreme. Admiral Anderson. Shepard. What about you guys? Committee? Donut Day? We were like strawberry. You would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me. Oh, gee, I wonder what it could be. What you already know. The Reapers are here. Saying it for years, then, haven't I? How do we stop them? Stop them. This isn't about strategy or tactics. Just my shoes. That's this what you do. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are, more powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us, and they'll never take pity on us. But there must be some way. Well, we have to stand together. We got to band everybody. Uh, got to get everybody up. Update everybody together. Get if the band back have together. Any chance at surviving this? Go on tour. <laughs> we have to stand together. That's it. That's our plan. Admiral, oh, please, bitch! Like, like you got moves. something else. Oh boy, they're coming. They couldn't be that close already. Oh, they get well, it's about to get defenses. loud, people. So. Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. I feel loud and scary. <laughs> Told you. I'm going to really need to adjust that volume. <laughs> Turn my headset down a little bit. Oof. Why haven't we heard from Admiral Hackett? He's probably out there being a badass. What do we do? Pray. 
the only thing we can. We fight or we die. We should get to the Normandy. I hope you all regret your decisions of not believing me. There he is. Oh, my ass. Somebody lift me off my ass. Drag me. My legs are broken. I'm Joker now. I'm brittle, I'm brittle boned. Shepard! Shepard! Oh, five seconds ago, we were having a meeting in this room. That's garbage. Here, take this. We've got to get moving. This is Admiral Anderson. Yes. Report yes. anyone. Major Alanko, is that you? What's your status? I can't raise the normal. You'll have the content. We'll meet you at the landing zone. Anderson up. Right, I got the sticks. I got the sticks. I'm ready to go. Remember? All right, hold on, hold on, Anderson, hold the fuck on. Uh, let me adjust my sound here. Right, turn it down to 55. Okay. Uh, squad, we got 12, we got 12 points. Fitness, fitness, dick in your mouth, what? Uh, <laughs> yeah, fitness. Uh, so yeah, this is kind of how the, the, the whole thing goes. You can see here, um, like, you have, uh, you can, like, choose between, like, oars or oars, or whatever the fuck. Um... Let's see here, fitness. Obviously, we want that. So this is oh, this is six points. So we can do durability, so health and shield, or melee damage. And trust me, I say melee damage is actually pretty useful in this because we get the Omni Blade, which is pretty tight. So melee damage is actually useful. Yeah, reputation bonus, that's what we want, yep. Oh yeah, weight capacity bonus. Headshot damage. I mean, adrenaline rush, I mean, incendiary ammo, to be honest, is... This is a burst. Ammo capacity, for sure. But we're going to leave this for now because uh, I honestly, well, uh, you know, let's, let's do this. We'll save the two points. Um, our Renegade is way down there. Our Paragon is, is up. So we're doing pretty well for ourselves. Sovereign Codex, so yeah, Sovereign, the Reaper called Harbinger. We already talked to both of those fuckers. Biotics is when subject elements to like sit on it for a sec. No associates. Major Caden Admiral Admiral The Systems Alliance. Two centuries in the early twenties. The Elcor are the Geth are the Hanar are when the Asari The Hanar jellyfish driven from their the Volus are a member species. The Asari were the, the second speed, roughly twelve hundred. Get rid of all, get rid of all these. Call Krishan. Just so we know what we, uh, we don't need to, uh, check, but. Pretty much, you know, stuff from that carried over from Mass Effect 1 and 2. Hey, how it doesn't just, uh, you know. Well, 
Well, Ragnar aren't extinct anymore, so. Alright, so we got that. Um. Let's just drop a Come nice on, little Kevin. save. Let's move. Let's move. Look out! We got laser. How do you stop something so powerful? I don't know. Tell me. Take a running jump. It's farther than it looks. Oh yeah, you gotta run and, and you hold to jump across things. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on, let's keep moving. Major, you read me. I'm patching in Shepard. We're almost to the Normandy. I've got Lieutenant Vega with me. We're taking heavy fire. You should probably look around We're a little bit, right? We're about five minutes out. Say again? Major! Damn it! Huss! Take him out! Where? Shoot him! I'm out of ammo. Come on, we gotta move. Oh, you're sliding down the elevator? Have to take these things out the old fashioned way. So, yeah, the uh, on blade. Oh, yeah, there we go. Don't let him grab you. Be a hold B for Omni Blade. Tap B for regular melee. Woo! It's always uh, really fun to like run up to an enemy and just Gotta give them the old, the old fucking spike punch. Oh, I have 50 experience. Already collected. Here we go. Watch it. Heavy melee. Already. Already figured that out. Through this way. Hello? Hey. Little boy. It's a little boy it's from okay. outside. Everyone's dying. to get you someplace safe. Take my hand. You can't help me. Shepard! In here. It's gone. Ah, this is a goddamn mess. Every minute these machines are here, thousands of innocent people die. I won't be responsible. It's hard enough fighting a war, but it's worse knowing no matter how hard you try, you can't save them all. Exactly. I get so fast. I thought we'd have more time. We knew they were coming. And they still just cut through our defenses. Oh, we yeah. need to go to the Citadel. Talk to the Council. The Citadel? The fight's here. It'll be everywhere soon enough. You said it yourself. <sighs> the Reapers will destroy everything if we don't stop them. The Council has to help us. <sighs> you sure about that? No, but you were a Council Specter. That has to count for something. Right. Use that Specter status for a while. By the way, don't mind me yawning. I haven't had a nap today, so. Grab some ammo. Reload. Let's keep moving. Mm. 
Copy. You two all right? Get down, they'll see you. Well, these are the Reaper, the Reaperized Terrians. Nice stuff. Finish them all. Yeah, cannibals. Well, Chapman, over here. They're basically like husk versions of Batarians. Um. And they have that for, you know, uh, all different types of... It's, they have them for um, Returians, they have them for Asari, you'll see them. What happened here? Um, Our gunship was shot down. We barely made it. You have a radio? We're trying to contact our ship. No. There's one in the gunship, but it's gonna be crawling with those things. Stay here, son. We'll get you out of here. Come on, let's get to that gunship. Okay, it's full. shot and my adrenaline rush okay just making sure it all works the same way Radio. There we go, assault rifle, not bad, not bad. Normandy, this is Anderson. Do you read? Admiral, what's your location? By a downed gunship in the harbor. I'm activating its distress beacon. Send support. We've got wounded down here. Major! Damn it! I've lost the signal. Let's hope that beacon does its job. And fast, we've got company. Woo! Maniacs gonna go up like real fast.
Vamos, ó. So yeah, here's our SR. So you remember our SR2? I told you it would be uh, even better. Oh, we've gone from a Cerberus ship to an Alliance ship. She's big and she blue now. Welcome aboard, Shepard. Thanks. Shepard! Come on! I'm not going. You saw those men back there. There's a million more like them, and they need a leader. We're in this fight together, Anderson. It's a fight we can't win. Not without help. We need every species and all their ships to even have a chance at defeating the Reapers. Talk to the Council. Convince them to help us. What if they won't listen? Then make them listen. Now go! That's an order! I don't take orders from you anymore, remember? Consider yourself reinstated, Commander. Nice. You know what you have to do. I'll be back for you, and I'll bring every fleet I can. Good luck. You too, Shepard. I'll be back sometime, you know, a few weeks, a couple months, I don't know. This is the Mass Effect 3 theme. It's called uh, the, end of all th uh, the End of All Things, I believe. It's actually what the title track is. Or an, or an end to all things. And there's a the little boy. This game is pretty sad. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, we're gonna lose friends in this. So pre prep your prep your uh, your tissues. Space Where's Anderson? Anderson? this one? Where are we going? Hey! Dead Space 3. Leaving. Think? Leaving? What's going on? Anderson wants us to go to the Citadel, get help for the fight. Bullshit! He wouldn't order us to leave. We don't have a choice. Without help, this war's already over. Forget it. Drop me off someplace. Enough! Don't you think I'd rather stay and fight? We're going to the Citadel. You want out? You can catch a ride back from there. Commander! Joker, is that you? What's up? Alive and kicking. Got an emergency transmission from Admiral Hackett for you. Patch it Hey! Through. Shepard. Same heavy losses. The force was overwhelming. Anderson's already ordered me to the Citadel to talk to the Council. First, I need you to find the outpost on Mars. We lose control of the system. 
Yes, sir. I've been researching the Frothian archives with Dr. Tassoni. We found a way to stop the Reapers. Hey. Joker, set a course for the Mars archives. Mars? Roger that. Oh yeah, we're heading to Mars. To I, I mentioned in the last game that we're going to be headed to Mars. Why Mars? What do you think we'll find there? I don't know. Yet. But if it helps us win this war. Grab your gear. Grab the old titty armor. Hey! Oh, five Gs, that's it? Fuck you, game. Yeah, we have a bit of a controlled story for a little bit here, as you can see. We don't get to just explore willy-nilly yet. We do a little bit first. Any sign of Reaper activity? Negative. Edie? The base appears to be online. It's possible the inhabitants were evacuated. We'll know soon enough. Be ready, Joker. Just in case. Roger that. Normandy out. We're almost there. So yeah, James is one of the new characters. We have a couple others that we'll uh, we'll have, but a lot of them mostly are our old companions. Previous games we're gonna meet up with and everything. Some of which will join us, some of which won't. So just like Mass Effect 2, but uh, they all have stories. So. Base, but we've got a massive storm headed our way. How long till it hits? Half hour tops. After that, we're gonna have difficulty keeping up comms with the Normandy. Understood. Alright. So, let's see here. I have six points now. Um. Increase shield recharge delay. Increase melee damage by 75% for 30 seconds after an enemy is killed. I'd probably rather do this. Yeah, we gotta do all of them as well. So, yeah, so um, Caden's got barrier. Force armor with biotic fields. He's got Reeve, drain targets health and disrupt their resistances. Uh, receiving increased damage protection while his power is in effect. Overload, cryo blast, and alliance officer. Uh, I always do at least like the first uh, three of all of these. Probably the first one uh, increases damage. Additional target within eight meters, six percent less damage. Let's do increase damage, and we'll do second one in barrier. Okay, for James, he's got fortification, reinforce armor using protective uh, full cult currents. Purge the current and send its charge to your gauntlets for increased melee damage. Frag grenade, incendiary ammo, carnage, arms master. Let's do at least the first one in frag grenade. Uh, let's see here, carnage. Arms master.
Let's give him three for all those. Okay, priority Mars. Sectors are the Citadel. A lot of crap that's gonna show up. Cerberus, a sorry made cyclonic Yep, our upgrades, of course. Cannibals are front husks are the aggressive Although melee comes. Fall of Earth. Alright. So here we are. I'll level up again. Man, that's a huge storm. Sure. Looks a lot bigger in person. Pretty average for more. Yeah, it's pretty actually. fucking huge. I'm Okay, so our power stuff. Uh, right bumper for. Got some shot, left bumper for that. Glad you're soft. Okay, what do we got? Oh, we got the katana, we got the Avenger. The mystic. Yeah, we've got Reapers invading Earth. The station here is offline. A little dust storm seems like the least of our worries. Fair enough. Alright, so just like with everything, we're going to make sure that we check around. So I want to be able to make sure that we grab things that we need to grab. Don't like missing stuff, you guys know that. What's that? Uh yeah, I'd probably rather have this in the shotgun. Oh, well, I can actually I yeah, got power recharge speed. I forgot about weapon mods. So yeah, you can change if you want to like have like certain guns. So I mean, typically like obviously with me, uh, I mean I'll have the pistol as a backup, but we'll carry this like. I think we might actually be able to use like an SMG as well. Remember. You can change your outfits on you can change your loadout on the fly and shit, so. Over here. Powers recharge faster if you uh carry less gear on you, so. Holy shit. They're executing them. Soldiers. There go. There's other sniper. There's other sniper rifles that I. You have more rounds. Servers. What are they doing here on Mars? Good question. You don't know. I'm not with them anymore, Caden, if that's what you're asking. It wasn't, but you have to admit, it's a bit, uh, convenient. So like I had mentioned in the previous playthrough, Cerberus will be kind of like the primary enemy that's human that we're going to be fighting. Just 
check around, make sure that we're not missing anything. More or less. I did. Well, one thing's for sure. They're no friend of the Alliance. Agreed. Shepard, I need a straight answer. Caden... Don't Caden me. This is business. Do you know anything about why Cerberus is here? What makes you think I know what they're up to? You work for them, for God's sakes. How am I not supposed to think that? We join forces to take down the Collectors. That's it. There's more to it. They rebuilt you from the ground up. They give you a ship. Resources. What is your Let point, man? Here. I've had no contact with Cerberus since I disabled the Collector base. And I have no idea why they're here now or what they want. Commander Shepard's been under constant surveillance since coming back to Earth. No way they've communicated since. Sorry, Shepard. It's just a... Yeah, that's that's why you and me are not who we are. You of all people should know what I'm about, Kate. Please trust me. I do. I'm sorry. I didn't mean. Yara! Chasing her ass in the Yo, it's my blue thing! God, she is just the hottest. Listen, I got a thing for blue aliens. Easy there, Lieutenant. All right? Well, She's with listen, us. <laughs> this particular blue alien. All right, let's not Shepard, talk about. Thank the goddess you're Avatar. alive. Liara. I was worried when the right. reports came in. They hit Earth hard. Yeah. They pretty much just smacked us. Smacked us like up. Caden, I'm sorry. Why do you come here? Packet ordered hey, you, us to come. Babe. Said you know what was going on. I do. Hallelujah. Some answers, finally. Maybe. I've discovered plans for a Prothean device. One that could wipe out the Reapers. Here? On Mars? In the Prothean archives, yes. We've known about the archives for decades. Why now? Process of elimination. Mixed with a little desperation. When you destroyed the Alpha Relay, you bought us some time. But then you were under investigation. I knew I had to do something. Hackett knew it too. He contacted me, asking if I would use my resources as a Shadow Broker to find a way to stop the Reapers. My search led me here. Hackett got me access to the archives and kept me updated on your status. I meant to come see you. I was under house arrest. There wasn't much I could do to help you anyway. I suppose you're right. In any case, my work paid off. The archives are full of data, an overwhelming amount. I think I found what we need. I guess I'll believe it when I see it. Where do we find this weapon? It's not a weapon, not yet. It's plans for a device, a blueprint. It's more than we had a minute ago. How do we get it? The archives are just across that tramway. Assuming Cerberus hasn't locked it down. What are they after? Yeah, they seem hell-bent on catching you. They want what I'm here for. What we're all here for. But why? The Protheans came close to defeating the Reapers. They had plans to destroy them, but ran out of time. And anything powerful enough to destroy the Reapers? Just might be something Cerberus would be interested in. So it's a race to the archives. Yeah, but I always win, so. Bring it on. Not this time, James. What? Get back to the shuttle. If Cerberus beats us to the archives, I need you covering the exits. No, I want James what? here. 
now. Uh, I don't want Caden here. No, keep James. I like James more. I like Freddie Prince Jr. Uh, I hear you. We should take cover. Looks like they Bring it on, us. bitch. I love the transition, by the way. There are, give me a singularity. You can't hide forever. Give me an overload. He walked right into the singularity. What an idiot. Alright, speaking of which. Um, Liara, Singularity is always great. One of my favorites. Stasis stops the enemy tracks of the powerful Mass Effect field. That up a little bit. Warp ammo. Eh, warp. Warp is good. Pure biotic. Get her stuff. Oh, yeah, I know. Uh, power recharge speed bonus. Yes. Uh, and we're going to do uh, some singularity. Do we want to do radius or duration? I mean, duration's already pretty good. Let's do radius. Shalt we? Shalt? Shalt. Originally created. And I think I'll do, I think I'll go through all of these, like the codex Dr. stuff. Leon. Uh from here on out, like, um, off camera, just because of the time things, so. Alright. Medi med kid. I miss James already. How'd Cerberus get into the facility? Not sure. One minute we were getting reports of the Reaper invasion. The next, there was chaos. Didn't even realize it was Cerberus at first. Could they be working with the Reapers? Doubtful, but I suppose anything's possible. Mm -hmm. Checking to make sure that I'm not missing anything. Point of the truck. Oh yeah, so I can like run across here. Do that. That's blocked off. Shepard, take cover. Don't you see Larry? Yeah, faster like powers recharge. It's fucking amazing. We'll need access to the pedway. Controls should be nearby. From Cameron Harrison to Exogeny Corp. Uh, Miss Mika, thank you for your kind offer of new and cutting-edge technology. As with every other offer you've made, we're going to have to decline. Our proprietary rights uh, experts have gone over your contacts again and found them lacking again. And, in short, we're not interested. Please don't con contact us anymore with your generous offers. Best, C. Harrison. Wow, what a, what a shitty uh, thing to say to somebody. I was kind of a dick. Uh, we got some gauntlets, some gaunty gaunts. Damn it. Security console. We got another pistol here. Is this a submachine gun? 
I actually kind of like these better than, uh... And they have, like, the pistol has a little bit more damage, but this has, like, a better fire rate. I kind of like those. Shepard, see if you can gain access to the Pedway. I can't seem to unlock the live feeds, but... Did you see that? Who's that woman in the vent? Hello. There's a lady. That's Dr. Eva Kore. She got here about a week ago. Any luck? Pedway's been locked out. All right. Looks like there's construction nearby. We can get out on the roof. We can find a way around from there. Great. Let's move. Okay. You guys know me. I mostly use my assault rifle anyway, so... position was. Good point. That's what he wants to know. This airlock shouldn't be open. Oh, I forgot about the dodge rule. Like it was forced open. No, you have to override security protocols. Five points. Squad me damage, increase headshot damage. Okay. Your ammo, increase ammo capacity, headshot damage. Force the damage to frozen targets increases recharge speed. Oh yeah, that's right. It infused with the ammo that you have. Um, let's do recharge speed for that. Give him the third barrier to damage reduction or blast radius of detonation. Um, let's do the damage reduction. Oh, I have to purchase this one. Duh. I wasn't even paying attention to that. Someone vented the air from this room while they were still here. Looks like they died trying to claw their way out. This is brutal, even by server standards. Oh, what do you expect? To show Dehen, uh, to from show Dehen to Cameron Harrison. Cam, who the hell is that woman messing in my files? Get her out of here. I won't have my system messed up by some wannabe expert who will be gone next week. Damn strangers who think they know it all but don't care about what we're really trying to achieve here. Uh, Dr. Eva, seriously? Don't you remember what happened last time? S. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Fools. It's got an SMG scope. I think this, uh, sorry. Oh, I can't choose. I can't choose my lower hand. But, uh, I can put that on my SMG. Or any of these people Always want to look around for stuff. I recognize a few, but I can't say I knew them. As the only Asari here, I think perhaps I was viewed with a little suspicion. I spent most of my time researching alone, translating. And what did you discover? Bits and pieces, really. Clues. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. In that time, the few Prothean survivors searched desperately for a way to stop the Reapers. If my translations are correct, they found a way. But in the end, they didn't have the resources to follow through with their plan. We need to pressurize the room first. There we go. We have access to the labs. They'll take us right to the tram station. Hey, there's a recording of what happened here. Well, let's watch it. Security station, come in. We're seeing some odd activity down here. Our security protocols just kicked in. Everything's locked down. Doctor, I'll get you a report as soon as... Oh, shit! Cerberus got in. I should have realized it when I met her. I was just so focused on finding a way to stop the Reapers. Stopping the Reapers is the only thing we should be focused on. It's not your fault. But what if we're wrong? What if there's no way to stop them? What if these are our last days and we spend them scurrying around trying to solve a problem we can't fix? Come on, Liara. I know. I shouldn't think that way. I don't know how you do it. You've always stayed focused, even in the worst situations. When there's so much at stake, I just think about what I'd lose if I fail. Don't look at him! That's a terrible burden. Don't look at him! You look at her! Together. Thanks, I want you to you look at that you. man. Don't you look at him and say that. You look at her, goddammit. Okay, doors open. I swear to God, I will... To the labs and I will through there. come through this Good. screen and I will fuck up all of Earth your moves. lives. Look at that. Fucking look at that man again. Don't you do it. Don't you dare. Screaming on the inside of how angry I am this game fucking betrayed me. Everybody betray me. Alright, so yeah. Uh weapon mod. We can we can do a little scope. It increases the accuracy by fifteen percent, and it has a times two optical. So it even makes the gun look kinda cool too. Show you this, uh, show you this. So you get like a scope on here as well. Boop, boop, boop. There's something here. Ooh, ultralight materials? Oh. Yeah, that's gonna happen a lot where I do the little dodge. And then, uh,. So yeah, ultralight materials reduces the weapon weight by 50%. Superior lightweight alloys replace weapon parts, making weapons less obtrusive and easier to handle. So you can put those on. You can see it changes the color of the gun as well, which is pretty cool. So yeah, oh, there is a uh, there is a view too, isn't there? So yeah, now it makes it so that we can, uh, our powers recharge faster again. Alright, give me a singularity. I actually kind of like SMGs in this game, just because, like, they're a, a nice little, like, uh, weapon that you can have uh, that kind of just is different than what you normally were using for the past three games, especially if you're not used to using SMGs like me. Uh, from Faisa Haikal Tequil, 
to Sandoval Fletcher. Yeah, I know, two external specialists in the same week is a bit insane. But Hudson, I've heard about the Asari before. She really, She's really well known, and she's done some amazing research on the Protheans. I don't know zip about that Dr. Eva chick, but Liara to Sony? She's the real thing. I'm attaching some of her advanced papers on Prothean culture. Read them. You're, uh, you'll be a believer too when you're done. You'll be a believer too when you're done. You like Justin. I can't wait till they introduce her to people. This is so exciting. Fiza. You'll be a believer too. <laughs> I'm a believer. Can I get a singularity? Disappeared now. Can I get a singularity? There we go. Oh, look at all this, uh, like soil you've picked up from the surface. That stench. They just activated the decontamination protocols. With the staff still inside. There we go. This is where they studied the various relics on Earth here. What did they find? More than I could describe in a short conversation. And they'd only scratched the surface. There are vaults filled with Prothean data troves that have never been studied. Data pad. Uh, we haven't been able to decipher much, if any of the language yet, but the visual documentation gives us um, some ideas to what we're studying, namely us. They seemed particularly interested in early humanity's evolutionary process, judging by the way they organized their files on highlighted specific occasions. It seems a bit fantastic to write this, but everything indicates that they seem to be trying to chart the curve of humanity's intellectual progression. Very interesting. That's the tram line. Takes us right to the archives. No doubt Cerberus has it locked down. Hopefully we can override it at the security station. It's just through here. See, we can really sprint now compared to the previous games. We got a good old run on us now. Uh oh. Auto turn. Oh god. I take it that's the only way in. It's the only way I know of. We'll skirt around it. Stay out of its sights. I'll move up first. Don't let it target. Hayden, if you stand and you stand and you absorb all the bullets for me. Damn it. 
Kara, shut up. The turret can't fire on us from here. Damn it! Okay, there's... Down here... There go, there's the ammo that I've been waiting to get. Uh, got a med kit here. Auto turret controls. Uh, research notes from Jay Tasman. The last location seems to have run dry, but judging from the communication system layout and the backup power supplies equipped by the first Prothean research base we discovered, we think a secondary base may be located deeper underground. We're going to need permission from the powers that be to excavate further, but considering the recent renewal of enthusiasm for the work we're doing here, I don't think clearance will be an issue. Yeah, they were really on a shit. Sniper rifle concentration module. Okay. Oh, auto turn time. Set up a perimeter. No one else comes across. We still have teams on the other side. No one. And shut down those cameras. Looks like they've made it to the archives. And I doubt they'll just send us a tram. Can you override it? The archives are on a separate network. We're completely locked out. Not if we can find a short-range communicator, helmet to helmet. And? And we convince them that we're on their side, tell them the Alliance forces have been taken care of. Good idea. See what you can find. What? The Major has become very capable. That he has. Shepard! I found something. What have you got? He's got a transmitter in his helmet. If I can... My god. Looks like a husk. Yeah. Yeah, he does. They've definitely done something to him. And by they, you mean Cerberus? They did this to their own guy? Is this what they did to you? How can you compare me to him? Shepard, I don't know what you are, or who. Not since Cerberus rebuilt you. For all I know, God. you could be their puppet. Controlled by the elusive man himself. Maybe you're a puppet, Elmo. Hey. Shut the fuck up. Don't try to explain it. I don't think I'd understand anyway. I just want to know, is the person that I followed to hell and back, the person that I loved, are you still in there? Somewhere. That's all in the... No, I'm not giving you the saddest fucking faction. You? Cerberus, it's all in the past now, Caden. We have a war to fight, and that is all that matters. Understood. I'm not your... Good. I'll say some really offensive shit. Come on, let's see what Cerberus is up to. Maybe we'll both get some answers. I'm not your little baby Hello, doll, all right? Like, Delta I'm not your girlfriend. Anybody there? I never was. Where the hell have you been? We're at the tram station, waiting for extraction. All hostiles terminated. Roger that. Echo team will ride over and secure the station. Think they bought it? They didn't. They'll figure it out soon enough. We should get in position. Flank them when they get off the tram. Good thinking, Major. Oh, yeah. So we can order people to move. Can 
I get a singularity. Hop on. We're going on a trip. In our favorite rocket ship. Storm's getting bad. We better wrap this up quickly. The archives are right on the other side. That and a squad of angry Cerberus troops. <laughs> Oh god. Can I get a singularity? So far, how has it? I just love like using singularity com just combined with any gun. It's just they just lift off and they're just floating there. Like I said, you can see how useful the uh, the use of an SMG is, especially with a little scope on it. Oh hell yeah, we have the vindicator. So yeah, the vindicator has a little bit less capacity, a little bit less fire rate, but it better damage. Weighs a little bit more. Accuracy is better, though. So, yeah. I like uh, like having that. So you can see it fires in bursts. Shotgun Shredder Mod. We have this door here. There's a door over here though, wasn't there? Oh, it's red. Plus, the Vindicator, the burst fire is good for, like, uh, you know, 
controlled shooting. Oh boy, look who it is. Shepherd. My favorite cigarette smoking man. Elusive man. Fascinating race, the Protheans. They left all this for us to discover, but we squandered it. The Alliance has known about the archives for more than 30 years. And what have they done with it? What do you want? What I've always wanted. The data in these artifacts holds the key to solving the Reaper threat. I've seen your solution. Your people are turned into monsters. Hardly. They're being improved. Improved? That's what separates us, Shepard. Where you see a means to destroy, I see a way to control, to dominate and harness the Reaper's power. Imagine how strong humanity would be if we controlled them. Earth is under siege, and you're hatching a scheme to control the Reapers? Anyone can destroy, but great civilizations do more. You know that. It's why you kept the Collector base intact. I gave you that base to find a way to stop the Reapers. You failed. This isn't your fight any longer, Shepard. You can't defeat the Reapers, even with the Prothean data. Work with me. Give me control of your resources, and I'll stop them. You'd do better than most, but the odds aren't in your favor. More importantly, I don't want the Reapers destroyed. We can dominate them, use their power, harness their very essence to bring humanity to the apex of evolution. You've gone too far. The Reapers will kill us all if we don't stop fighting each other. I don't expect you to understand, Shepard, and I'm certainly not looking for your approval. You were a tool, an agent with a singular purpose. In that, you were successful. But like the rest of the relics in this place, your time is over. Enough talk. Liara? Don't interfere with my plan, Shepard. I won't warn you again. Duly noted. Shepard. What? The data, it's not here. Goodbye, Shepard. Damn it. Well, you know. How's he doing it? It's local. Someone's uploading the information. Yeah, the lady. Hey, step away from the console. Now. Listen, bitch, back it up. Oh, please, kick his ass if you can, please. I'm totally fine with that. She's got the data. She's faster than she looks. Stay close. Woo! We can't lose her. Get over here, bitch. Oh, you. There she is. Stay on Woo! her. No, she's not. Watch out! Over there. Whoa! Down there. Come here, you bitch. James, you read me? <laughs> Cerberus has the data. Radio the Normandy. Get them down here now. I could have literally tackled her ass like five times. I got this one. Yeah, Freddy Prince Jr. 
Okay, well, try to kill us, why don't you? Freddy. Christ. Are you good? Yeah. Alive. Well, I hope so. That you've wrecked our ass. We need the data. Still in there. She's a robot. Yeah, please, smash his skull open. Let him go. Orders. Dispose of him. No! Oh. I'm fine with that. Grab that thing. Bring it with us. Shepard! Especially after all the bullshit that I've had to deal with with him. Fucker can live in a coma for a little while. Caden needs medical attention. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. Get us to the Citadel, Joker. Roger that. Hold on, Caden. See what you and Edie can learn from that thing. Me through. I'll forward it to the call room. Commander. Edie, can you clear this up? I'll do my best. Did you get to the archives? I was there. So was the elusive man. I was worried Cerberus might try something. Did you get the data? Most of it. He downloaded some before I could stop it. Edie and Liara are analyzing what we recovered. What have you learned? Was it worth the effort? Preliminary evidence suggests the data is a blueprint for a Prothean device. Device? A weapon, massive in size and scope, that's capable of unquantifiable levels of destruction. Send me the data. We'll do our own analysis. If Liara's instincts are right, this might be the key to stopping the Reapers. I hope so. Caden's been hurt. We're taking him to the Citadel. Sorry to hear that, Shepard. But we both know this is just the beginning. Talk to the Council, show them what you found. With luck, they'll give you all the support we need. And if they don't? Do whatever it takes to get them on board. I'll be in touch soon. Hack it out. Commander. Edie is extracting data from the Cerberus machine. We'll have details to present to the Council by the time we... That's nice, I don't care. Alright. And Caden? I don't care about Caden. what I can for him, but we need to get him to a medical facility soon. No. No, we don't. The Admiral's right. It's going to get worse, isn't it? 
Unless well, we stop yeah. the Reapers, yeah. I've looked at the data. This weapon could be the answer if we can build it. I get the sense you don't quite believe it, though. You didn't see what they did to Earth. How is one weapon supposed to stop them? What are our options? You know we can't win this conventionally. Maybe if we just invite the Reapers to Commander? Donut Day. Isn't it worth trying at least? I'm gonna check on Caden. Make sure we're ready to present our findings to the Council. I'm sure the Council will see the need to help. It'll be a hell of a short war if they don't. You know, I, I, I literally, like, was was a little bit too friendly to Caden just a little bit in the first game. And now it's just like, oh, your lover, Caden, Alenko, your bae, your booty call, your fiancé. No, fuck off, game. I am not interested in Caden. I don't want to see him. I don't... I... I'm regretting saving anybody from Aspect 1 in that position at this point. I got rid of the space racist to keep around the fucking cooing lover boy. Ugh. Just leave me alone, dog. Back the fuck up. Don't want to be a part of your agenda. Your agenda. I'm not your boo I'm not your your baby mama, all right? <laughs> Just leave me alone. Barely got a pulse here. Move him out. Where are you taking him? Where to Memorial. Best care in the Citadel. Where to Memorial. We're not going with? We need to see the council. Right. Looks like they might be coming to see you. Commander. Oh Shepard. well. It's Captain Bailey. Arriving. Captain what Bailey. Up, my dog. Good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Though it's Commander now. Oh. Congratulations. Uh, thanks. Now half my job is dealing with political bullshit and escorting dignitaries around. No offense. None taken. You're escorting me. So you're here to bring us to the council? <laughs> I'm escorting here to tell me? You the council really? is expecting you, but they are dealing with their own problems with the war and everything. Uh, they apologize for the inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. Meet them here at Adina's office. They'll be ready soon enough. All right. All right. You might have time to go by the medical center if you want to check on progress over there. Thanks. I might do that. You go on ahead. I'll head up to Adina's office. One of my men can show you the way. You? I'm just a tourist today. I'll try not to get in any trouble. <laughs> We've got a situation in the embassy quarters. We could use your help. Hmm. I'll be right there. He's you not even holding his hand to his ear. It's like I'll hand is like around, through a couple inches no away doubt. from his head. Oh, thank fuck. Oh, you see all that money that I got, by the way? Look at that. 35,000 big O's. Alright, so now we have a map. Um, one leads back to the Normandy airlock. Three is the viewing deck. Two is the passenger lounge. And there's it'll show you that there's characters, too, yeah. Um, and four is the security checkpoint. I think I can go and. Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah, my last funny. Hey, Welcome Bina! Here. Welcome to the Citadel. This is Docking Bay D. Note that due to recent yeah. events, official identification and weapons permits may be requested by CSEC personnel for routine verification. Alright. What else is in the area? You are standing in Docking Area D24. According to your biometrics file, you are this is the airlock yeah, yeah. assigned to the Systems Alliance ship Normandy. If you look out the bay window, you can see one of the many magnificent vistas for which the Citadel is renowned. What about that room over there? The waiting area is for those who wish to speak to our new arrivals. It is located next to security processing. 
What's with the heightened security? New screening fields have been added in order to speed up processing at the security stations in each docking area. Citadel security screening technology uses highly advanced biometric authentication systems developed by the CERTA Foundation. Please note that any attempt to circumvent Citadel security measures will result in... That's all. Please speak with me again if you require further assistance. Okay. Diana! Here. Commander, just who I was looking for. Diana Allers, Alliance News Network. I think we can help I'm you. I'm wherever you are. I don't have the greatest track record with reporters. I know, and it hasn't exactly endured you to a galactic audience. But that can change. I'm a military reporter okay. with a show called Battle Space. Jessica Chobot? Just all council planets. My producers want me embedded Sorry, on the ship, and I want that ship to be the Normandy. Why would I want that? Wars can be won or lost in the editing room, and this war needs to be won. I've got Alliance security clearance and operate without a crew. You get veto power over the segments I file. Can you handle an okay. arrangement like that, or do I keep looking? Let's do a trial Tell run. Tell producers yes for now. We'll see how it works out. Report to the ship as soon as possible. Any questions? How much gear can I bring? One footlocker. <laughs> aye, aye, Commander. One footlocker. <laughs> Alright, there you go, Alliance News Network. So yeah, Jessica Chobit, she, uh, she plays Diana. She's, uh, so yeah, we get war assets and stuff, as you'll see, as you, if we come across them. So. Aye. Aye. see all these uh, ships and stuff docked so we're getting another kind of like look at how the citadel is Welcome you know we didn't get to really shuttle. explore Please select a destination. One let's go to Huerta Memorial Hospital Huerta now Huerta, Huerta Memorial Hospital. we'll be actually coming here a couple of times um, not just to see Caden but to see another character Welcome to Serta. Serta supplies. Maybe I could be transferred to another hospital. Ooh, some Peruvian whiskey. TM88 Peruvian whiskey, tasty yet medicinal, the perfect gift. Smooth and smoky with a hint of heat. Each sip of TM88 is a story to tell, and each glass is a story to inspire. TM88 isn't one of the Earth's top-selling beverage exports for nothing. Known for having both a calming influence and the ability to stimulate blood flow, TM88 is the only alcoholic drink endorsed by the Thank medical board of Sir Kesh. The price of TM88 includes deposit. Please recycle. Medigel capacity increase. We'll get the Peruvian whiskey, which we'll need. Hello, Commander the humans yeah, I usually please ensure that you yeah. have property contamination protocols at all times while in this area. What else is in the area? The I just kind of usually skip over this. With access to cutting edge technology and support from major pharmaceutical companies, the hospital ensures the best care. You can really cover treatment for any kind of species here. Huerta Memorial. Yeah, it's the, it's the, it's the Citadel, so yeah. Environments, for example, are what about the medical staff? All per hospital. It is imperative they be I usually just skip over these for I don't know about the hospital name though. Where the hospital get its name. It is named after President Christopher Huerta of Earth's United North American States. The donor of the USA, bitch. Get it right. Desire to remain anonymous. <laughs> Fucking United States of America, freedom, bitch. <laughs> Thank you. 
Please, don't tread on me, Avina, you fucking <laughs> Hey, Doctor Doctor Chuck was Doctor Michael. What are you both doing here? Oh God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. What's going on? Uh oh God. What's going on? Oh God. There's like a there's like a an invisible wall here. What the fuck? Sixty dollar game, by the way. What the fuck? What the hell's the? F it was like a, gl a glitch. What the fuck happened? What the fuck? Anyway, uh, Doctor Chuck. Hey. Shepherd, there you are, Doctor Chuckwas. You're here. I'm working at an Alliance R&D lab down in Shelter Wards, coordinating closely with Admiral Hackett. I heard you escaped Earth in the Normandy, and that someone was critically injured. I came as fast as I could. We had a run-in with a Cerberus synthetic on Mars. Caden took the worst of it. How is he doing? Very well, all things considered. I'm impressed with Major Elenko's resilience, as well as Dr. Michelle's expertise. I wish I could have been there to help on Mars. It's Mitch- it's Mitchell. It's Michael, Michael Mitchell. You say Michelle, but it's not spelled like Michelle. What have you been up to? Been six months, Doctor. How have you been? Good. I've been fortunate. When they impounded Normandy, the Alliance didn't really know what to do with me. I was never officially part of Cerberus, and I'd gotten a proper leave of absence from my previous post. Oh, no, so you, you hadn't technically around. done anything wrong by joining me to defeat the Collectors. Yes. Though I suppose if you were judged to be a war criminal, I would have been tried as an accessory. Your place is in Normandy's med bay, not some lab. I couldn't agree more. You say the word and I'm with you. Welcome aboard. Normandy wouldn't be the same without you, Doctor. Get your things. Docking bay D-24. Yes, Commander. And thank you. Don't thank me so soon. Fuck Remember, yeah, Dr. Chakras is back. Aboard. And I'd be surprised if he's been remembering his medication. He probably hasn't. Hell yeah. That's Dr. Chuck. Oh, Dr. Michelle. Michael, where'd you go? There you are. Come on, Michelle. Um, Good to see you. Didn't think Dr. I wasn't going to forget about you. a long time. You've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards. Because of you, I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't dealt with Fist and his thugs. Now I'm med physician in the Presidium Clinic. You gave me this chance. I assume you're here about Major Alenko. You're also now, like, way more French. How is Caden doing? The head trauma was severe, but we reduced the swelling quickly. The head trauma was severe. The injury severe. can go either way. He hasn't regained Hey, I'm French. I can make fun of him. Are strong, so I'm optimistic. Get on my ass. I'm French. You can go see him if you like. He's just down the hall. The old. Plus, I've been playing Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I've been listening to like the most like, offensive French accents that there can. It's like, ah, the Dutch Chanel is going to come out get me. And you're just like, oh my god. It's like somebody who's never heard French people talk is <laughs> doing French accents. This war may leave a lot of injured people homeless. Can the Citadel clinics care for them all? We're fine now, Hell no. I'm worried. Every hospital in the Citadel is preparing for the worst. I hear the docks are tightly controlled, but we just can't leave people floating out there forever. Reminds me of Earth's hospitals being filled up with people who are sick with COVID. It's unfortunate. But maybe if you just go to the What? How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say I'm not worried about the future. We've posted Don't guards on the reserves. War profiteering has already begun. I mean, she was already French, but she's like more French now. It's like she's getting more French as it goes. With a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. It was nice to see you. Bye. All right, let's go see this dumbass. Patient's stable for now. That was touch and go. <gasps> Good work, Doctor Freeman. Uh, I was like, I was like, Mor Morton. I'll see if we have the um. So yeah, we got a little lab back here. Up there. Got another little lab right over here. 
Don't mind me, I have the security clearance. Here he is. In a coma. Ken? God. It's hard seeing you like this. Uh, actually, it's not for me, but... Don't know if you can hear me. But since you can't tell me to get the hell out either, I'm gonna take my chances. On your feet, so... <laughs> just get, just get right, like, really close up to him. Just stand, stand right by him, bitch, like... On your feet, so just right in his ear. Don't die, Caden. You've got to fight. Hey, we don't die. Chance. That's an order. Seeing soldier. Reminding me you're a hell of a soldier. The Alliance could sure use you. I could use you. There's just like a doctor standing behind Shepard. You need anything, dog, let me know. Fight it, Caden. You got your ass beat by a fucking Terminator. And that's an order. See? <laughs> On your feet, soldier. Hello? Hello? Is there anything in here I can steal? Do I have anything I can, like, nab? Can you imagine if there was another patient in here and I just walked in and they were just like, who are you? And be like, I'm a person looking for stuff. Your squad applied the medigel correctly, but infection had already set in by the time they found you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we have to remove your leg below the knee. What? Well, you're going to be an amputee now, sir. Oh, sorry, sorry. Stuck on your body. Okay, so from the hospital, uh, we got the whiskey, so we can bribe the council now. Um, I can't remember what the whiskey's for. Embassies. Hello everyone, hello. So yeah, if you walk around, sometimes you'll like hear stuff and you'll get like, uh, you'll get like quests from just like listening to people. So you kind of like stand around. When you hear talking, make sure you kind of like stand around a little bit. Because typically a quest will like spawn out of it. like this right here but we spoke about this already i told you about his mission and nonsense i just filled out the paperwork he's very punctual when he's on the field he checks in every week only he hasn't checked in for a while now a month anyway i'd like to file an expedited contact request yes of course ma'am but the notes on his file state he's not under a contact ban. Oh, you already looked. How kind of you. I'm just so worried. It's not like him to go for this. As soon as I get news, ma'am, I'll let you know as soon as I get news. Thank you. You're such a nice young woman. You know, you remind me of my daughter. I thought that was a quest. Well, I know that we ended up talking to her eventually, I believe, about her son. Commander there Bailey. No anti humanity conspiracy here, Ms. Al Jalani. The council's simply. Oh, Com Bailey, time. you got a problem with Al Jalani here? I'll punch her in the nose. And the council are denying them access. Listen, lady, you think I like playing gatekeeper between the paparazzi and the politicians? I don't have time to babysit them, and I'm not here to hold your hand. 
Well, I'm camping out until I'm granted an audience. I don't Fine. think you're gonna. I hope you brought a sleeping bag. Commander Shepard? See how fast? Commander Humanity has questions. <laughs> I'm gonna punch her in the face again. Impress. See, you're keeping the peace. Yeah, I feel like a glorified doorman. Most people would see it as a move up. Wedged in here with all the stuffed shirts? I'd rather be back down on the streets. I appreciate the higher pay grade, but I'm not a political creature. If you didn't want to be up, why'd you accept? <laughs> you don't say no to Councillor Udina. Well, maybe you would, but I gotta live here. <laughs> I know, sweet <laughs> Dread I would. gets the oil, but I didn't lobby for a promotion like some other officers. And not even sure why he picked me. I never know with politicians. I hate political BS. Don't lose your edge. You might need it. Oh, wouldn't mind an excuse to get my fingers dirty. <laughs> it's killing me about Earth. You and me both. I haven't been back in years. Now I may never. If this ain't the end of days, it's pretty damn close. Well... I'm up to my neck in trouble, but if there's anything you need, I'll do my damnedest to help. Let's ask him about some stuff, shall we? How about the war? Is the Citadel gearing up for war? Uh, there's a false sense of security here. Even people from worlds that have gone down act like they're safe. Well, I guess it's not just human nature. We all lie to ourselves to deal with horror. Anything important going on around here? <laughs> you kidding? With the Reapers running roughshod through the galaxy, it seemed like the Council is in constant session. We got more ambassadors and dignitaries here than ever before pleading their cases. But that's just the tip of the iceberg, really. Well, maybe they should have been talking to me. Thought things were relatively quiet here. Well, compared to where you're coming from, sure. But the war is being felt everywhere. Millions across the galaxy have been displaced, and most of them come here. Must have you doing somersaults. <laughs> yeah, already allocated the bulk of my men to customs, but we're still overtaxed, cataloging and processing them all. You got loved ones out there? Somewhere. Ex-wife I lost track of, and... And a son and daughter. They're still on Earth. I'm sorry, Bailey. Yeah, I'm just like everyone else. I'm losing myself and things I can control. And at the moment, that means creating the illusion of security here. It was Udina who made you a commander, huh? Yeah, he's become an even bigger shot around here. Got a lot of ambition. He suspected Executor Palin was conspiring against the Council and had me investigate. Find anything incriminating? Yeah, enough to arrest him. When Palin resisted, I was forced to kill him. Udina rewarded me with the promotion. And near as I can tell, being a commander just means I'm putting out different fires. Yeah, well, I feel the same way. It'll probably get worse before it gets better, Bailey. Yeah, if it ever gets better. <laughs> he says that, like, all the time when you talk to him. Yeah, if it ever gets better. Got a pretty big office, though, Bailey. It's pretty nice. I won't lie. The fuck is Jelani? That bitch still down here? Jelani, where the fuck are you? I'm gonna beat your ass. Yeah, that's right. She be oh, there she is. Commander Shepard. Commander, the people of the Alliance have questions. Commander Shepard. I'll give you some fucking answers. Police have been seen in Al Jelani. Isn't it true that you were on Earth when the Reapers attacked? How do you justify running away while <laughs> millions of people on Earth die? Is that the best? I've had enough of your tabloid journalism. Not this time, you militant. <laughs> <laughs> You're angry. I get that. But I came here to get help for Earth. Not answer your questions. Stay down. Recent intel suggests that the entire yeah, see? She thought... <laughs> yeah, we got some renegade, but listen, that's... She's worth punching every single fucking time. So, I'll, you know, take the little bit of Renegade if I have to. Let's 
think this is a like a room that we have to um it's like an interrogation room or some shit all right counselor udina commander counselor udina said you'd be coming if you'll follow me, Aye. the council is already in session. Counselor, the Reapers are in our space as well. Earth is no more or less important than any council homeworld. But Earth was the first council world hit. By all reports, it faces the brunt of the attack. How do you know this is the brunt? New Reaper fronts are opening up everywhere. The reports are accurate. Earth was attacked. A full-scale invasion. And it's just the beginning. We need your help. Everything you can spare. <laughs> Earth may be suffering, but our worlds are falling too. The Turians have lost Tetris. We must fight this enemy together. Need I remind you that the last time we fought the Reapers, Shepard sacrificed the Council to protect human interests. True, but in the end we survived because we followed Shepard's lead. And what if that's not enough this time? The reports are dire. If we throw everything we well, have at the Reapers on Earth and lose, what then? I you would have listened the first time. Without a plan. Counselors, we have that plan. A blueprint created by the Protheans during their war with the Reapers. Prothean? What is it exactly? We're still piecing it together. But it appears to be a weapon of some sort. And this is capable of destroying the Reapers? So it would seem. It's immense, and intricate. This is a fool's errand. The Protheans were wiped out by the Reapers. Clearly, the weapon is flawed. No, they weren't. They were turned it into the collectors. Incomplete. There was a missing component, here. Something referred to only as the Catalyst. But they ran out of time before they could finish building it. Do you believe in this, Shepard? After what you've seen of the Reapers? Liara believes it can work, and so do I. And while I haven't always agreed with Udina, he's right about this. We need to stand together, now more than ever. The Reapers won't stop it, Earth. They'll destroy every organic being in the galaxy if we don't find a way to stop them. It's true. The Council cannot give Earth the military support it needs. Our own planets must come first. The Salarian Union is convening a summit amongst our species. Of course. If we can secure our own borders, we may be able to aid you. Our fleets are also engaged. Honesty is all I can offer, Commander. I will not make a promise of rescue that I cannot keep. Shepard, meet me in my office. I hope that's an offer of support. I'll be digging up what I can on this Prothean device, Shepard. They're a bunch of self-concerned jackasses, Shepard. Well, it makes sense they don't want to help us right now. We may have a spot on the council, but humanity will always be considered second-rate. How can they be so blind? Commander, I can't give you what you're asking for, but I can tell you how to get it. I'm listening. Paladin's Primarch Fedorian is the one that called the War Summit. He's your kind of man. Open to extreme solutions. Trouble is, okay. he didn't get out of Palavin's system when the Reapers attacked. We don't know if he's alive. He's essential to the summit. If the Normandy could extract him without being detected. You want me to rescue his ass in the hopes he considers helping Earth? Put bluntly, yes. I shouldn't even be telling you about it. But we need Fedorian alive, and your ship can get him. Save the Primarch. Gain an ally, one with the power to grant you what you're looking for. Well, the Reapers <laughs> ravage Earth. Your counselor was right. We need to work together. This is the best way to get that. <laughs> Our intel says Primarch Fedorian is on Palavin's largest moon. Get in and out undetected, and he'll take care of the rest. Good luck, Commander. You're gonna need it. There is one other thing. The council has agreed to reinstate your Spectre status. And there are certain Hell yeah. resources that will be made available to you. Good luck. Well, that went well. It's a start. I'll talk to the others in the meantime. 
See if we can support this summit. Move things along. Thanks. Thanks. Do you have anything to talk about? The council. All I can think is that the more things change, the more they stay the same. I've always loathed that phrase, fatalism. Not what men and women should aspire to. If we don't figure out something, maybe later will be an epitaph on a mass grave of 11 billion. I know what I'm going to do. What are you going to do? Humanity is as feared as we are loved. Hopefully that works in our favor now. I'll try to get financial aid from as many worlds as I can. Maybe manpower, a few armed ships. I'll institute a draft in our colonies and order all civilian ships armed. Work on the Prothean device will be around the clock. Any news from Earth? That is constant news. All of it bad. The Reapers are destroying satellites and the old nuclear missile silos, along with everything else that could help. We have a handful of quantum entanglers spread out over the continents. All other communication is cut. What's your read on the counselors? Any angles I could pursue? Counselor Irissa is not like her predecessor. She is colder. If she has her hand on your throat, she will squeeze. A shield. There you might find some traction. Practical, she might make Machiavelli turn pale, but that's a Delatras for you. Frankly, it's good Quentius spoke with you. His home world is in the most trouble, and he's looking for a way out. That speaks opportunity. You're a Citadel counselor. Don't you have options when the others block you like this? With Parliament destroyed and Shastri gone, I have more power than any human in history. But today, you saw how little that is. Rest assured, I will not be counted out long. I know I can move mountains. Do not lose sight of that, because the task before us is moving planets. Anderson would be proud, so long as you deliver. You think you can do that? You need a carrot or a stick to drive a mule, and humanity has neither right now. Our armada is tied down fighting or fleeing, and with Earth's calm buoys gone, our economy is reduced to an IOU. But leave that part to me. I will lean on our colonies for all they're worth, and I can broker enough trade to repair and resupply Hackett's fleet. Did you know a lot of people on Earth? Many. It's monstrous to think of them being snuffed out, of course, but the part that gets me is Arcturus. I must know... I must have known most of the Alliance Parliament on a first-name basis. I required a second VI just to track all their birthdays and anniversaries. Rose Garden stuff, but to have it all gone. I should go. I'll be here. All right. Well, I think that's going to do it for our first part of uh, Mass Effect 3. Uh, when we return, we'll be heading back to the Normandy. Uh, we have to go to Palavin, of course. Um, we'll have a bunch of like DLC stuff around as well that we'll do. Uh, we'll be picking up a lot of stuff. Don't worry. It's, uh, you know... It starts out a little slow, but, uh, you know, so priority Palavan. We also have the Shrike uh, Abyssal, the uh, Prothean Obelisk. And, uh, yeah, so Reaper, I think that's what we'll do. Uh, are the aggressive. We'll do uh, next time. So take care, everybody, and I will see you all on the next one. Go ahead and save here. Uh, goodbye. Goodbye.